Okay, I can hear myself. All right, we got the Kyle C on the Rob. Not feeling the uh, the Paulo today due to a little uh, a little incident outside of that. Anyways, the Rob still coming in strong right now. Has used it ever since he uh, lost to Reed. He was originally gonna go pop a, uh, a character under under Rob a little, a little. It's a little under the tears right now. What the? Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I had to. Uh, I had to chill for a little. Well, the side. I did see that side of though. I, this is actually a really interesting matchup to me. Not necessarily because like uh. Because it's like I feel like Snake or Rob might struggle, but I I'd want to see how uh sees the gyro to like disrupt the grenade setups. Ooh, what a great parry! That's something Eli does really well. He loves his parries, but uh, Ooh. Ooh. that was a big down air, big down air from C right there. Gonna go back to PS2. No, we'll actually go to Smash Bros. I'm surprised he left it up. This is one of uh, Snake's better saves, notoriously. That C4 in the middle covers so much area, and the stage is smaller, so the area is even bigger by comparison. Snake is just a character. Like other than um, other than FD, Snake is a character that just benefits. For most of the stages. I mean, this lead Eli is built up. It's not even a stage thing. It's just a. There's some excellent ledge trapping right now. Oh, the Cypher coming in clutch twice there. That could have been very dangerous for Eli. That was a great gyro. You see? Big Darren Shield. He is at 150. This has been a. Very explosive match. No pun intended. That bear is so good. It lingers for so long. Wow. It's actually such a good, like, it's such a good, uh, it's not an all-purpose move, but it's really good in a lot of situations. It just lasts so long that f Smash barely not going to kill. Wow. I'm actually surprised he even went for that. Feeling a little, uh, crispy there with that f Smash. But this is the issue with Snake. The more, the more you let him live, the more likely he is to, like, Rack up percent, just trade, trade with the nades, all the big up tilt. See, has overlapped Eli, and he is down in stock. This is a bit disastrous. Has Eli got that match? No, he did not. We, other than like a funny gyro zero to death, which I'm sure Eli is looking out for, there isn't too many outs right now for C. One trade, one down throw up tilt. He is in that percent. He's past 160 or 159. Good F tilt, honestly. Ooh, interesting off there. A lot of snakes like to uh, pull, like, pull one grenade or pull the other and then like neutral get up with the second grenade. It kind of creates like this really good checkmate scenario that it's really hard to contest. But he'll actually do something different there, which is pretty creative. Oh, the bear didn't come out in time. It's so unfortunate for C. Yeah, I'm still very surprised that he left the stage up. Maybe he just doesn't care. No mix. Oh, great tomahawk. Is that gonna kill? Yeah, that was horrible DI. That was very hard at DI though, honestly. Such a tough situation. He was basically in the center of that, getting mixed up left and right. Oh, oh. This is not looking too good for C. 144 on ledge. He can't. I believe if he got down thrown, he can get detailed. He can definitely get up tilted now. Big laser. 53, 60. Oh. This can be very bad. He just keeps going. He this is actually his only out to win right now. He has to heat this momentum up. Oh, he still has really good stage positioning. 93. Bear is not going to hit for C. The Nikita gets neutralized. It's gonna go up. Will it come down? It's still ticking. He falls out of doubt. This is such, such a crazy one. 
match right now. The Rob is big me. Oh, that was just clean. That was just clean. That was such a great grab. Because it's like, what, what can C do right there? He has to spot dodge. Because if he gets shield, he gets comboed into the grab. If he rolls, there's a very good chance he just dies. That small setup at the end right there is like really good awareness from Eli. That grenade was just so well timed with the grab. Gotta give him props for that. Should have run it back to Rob. I actually didn't see where we went. I think PS2, yeah. This is still a good stage for Snake though. But it's like you put the you put the C4 under the PS2 platform. Or on it rather. And you just control like a third of the stage. Like, C4 is just such a great move, like where wherever it is. Only on like really big maps, like Battlefield and Town, is like where it, it starts to become less of a uh, less of a good move, but Sage Snake is really good on Battlefield, from what I know. Ooh, back here. I thought he was gonna go for the up air. What a Nikita! Oh my god! That was crazy. Uh, Eli? That was a really, really clean recovery from Eli. All uh, the schmixel schmecks, Eli would say. Great bear just dodging all of those grenades. And that C4 there from C. Now we're starting to see more and more of a even game. Wow, Rob Bear beating on Snake Dash attack. This just goes to show how big big that Nair is. Holy, Snake does have I think on the arms weak dash attack, so it's like... Oh, he's sticky! Oh, he's sticky! He's no sheep! Oh, he's no air dodge! That was actually... Oh... That was disastrous for C right there. Double up air. He's not gonna kill with that good BI. Oh, this might actually kill, though. Oh, another good BI. Snake is also a heavy. This... This set has, for this game more or less, actually, not this set, this game has been crazy. Super, just like, back and forth, very chaotic right now. Eli is up 100 plus percent right now. We've seen how long C can actually live for. Usually towing around like the 160, 150 mark, but, I mean, this is, this is Snake's game right here. He isn't, he isn't down throw up full percent, he just needs one pummel. This is so tense. I don't think that kills. Oh, it barely did. My bad, my bad, my bad. Eli takes it 2 1, but. Damn, that was a set. I believe.